Hi, my name is Bonnie Barker, and I'd like to show you the four stitch cable. I'm calling it a four stitch because it uses four uh, post stitches of varying types. Um, to begin with, we're going to do this stitch in a circle or in the round. Um, doing this because this suits the project um, that's appearing in Crochet Magazine. Um, so let's go ahead and begin. I've started out with a foundation row of 40 chains and then I've connected the chain using a slip stitch, chain two, and then 40 double crochets around in a circle and then I connected it using the loop of the first stitch, the first double crochet of the row, not the chain. I am not counting the chains as stitches as we go about here. I've chained two Let's go ahead and begin. I'm going to wrap the needle twice. I'm going to skip the, the turning chain because again, I'm not counting that as a stitch. I'm going to skip one, two double crochets, and then I'm going to do a front post treble crochet around the third stitch, like so. And I'm going to wrap it twice, and I'm going to do it around the fourth stitch. I'm doing front post treble crochet. Now I'm going to wrap the needle twice again because I'm going to now work around the two stitches that I skipped. I'm going to put treble crochets, front post trebles, one, wrap the needle twice, two. Okay, I'm going to do that all the way around. Wrap the needle twice. I'm going to skip the next two stitches. If you can see that, be careful. Sometimes when you see this stitch here, it's easy to think that stitch hasn't been crocheted around. Sometimes you may just have to touch it to make sure that that stitch is taken. So we're going to skip one, two, and we're going to treble around the third and fourth stitches. That's one. Now we're going to go back and do the two skip stitches. Oops. Okay, let's try that again. And just for the record, I'm using Barocco's Weekend DK Weight Yarn and a size I crochet hook. Um, I'm going to skip this stitch. It's already been taken. Skip one, two, and do this one more time for you. Okay, let's stop and see what we have so far. So far, this is what we have, which doesn't look like a whole lot just yet. Okay, I'm going to finish this round and I'll get back to you. Okay, I've gone completely around my circle and I'm going to join to the first stitch of the row. And let me just show you where that is. This is the first treble crochet we worked. We're going to do a slip stitch going through both loops, just like this. I'm going to chain two and we're going to turn and this row we're going to work back post double crochets, not trebles, but double crochets. Um, so we're going to kind of reach around the back and do back post double crochet. You may want to count to four for each cable that you have. This one might be a little tricky to do because I'm having to, I'm looping it over, reaching around the back. And, and this is really, as, as in a case with working uh, most back post work, it's more felt than seen. So make use of your, your thumb and your, and your um, middle finger there to, to make sure your needle is going around the entire post of the stitch. Okay, this is going to be the trickiest one. This is the third stitch of the each cable. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this over backwards and see if you can see this one all the way. Notice we're going around the post, not through the tops. And then here's the third one. 
I'll show you how that one looks from the back side. Okay. I'm going to do one more. One more cable here, then I'm going to pause. Okay. Okay, I've gone all the way around and I'm going to join again through the top loops of my first stitch of the row. Pull it through, chain two, and let me show you what we have so far. Okay, this is what we have. Okay, you have cables all the way around. Now for the next stitch or the next row of stitches, we're going to repeat the first row. It should be a little bit easier since you can see where the cables are forming. Okay, I've chained two. I'm going to wrap the needle twice. Now instead of doing double crochets, we're going to do front post treble crochets. So always remember do front post trebles when you're working from the front side and you're going to do back post double crochets when working from the back side. Okay, I'm going to let me start that again. I'm going to skip the first two stitches, wrap the needle twice for the treble, bring that in as so, and do the next one as well. Now we're going to go back and work the two skipped stitches. And I'm going to pulling through two, pulling through two, pulling through two on this treble. Just for the record, I could have done this earlier, but um, for a treble stitch, you're going to wrap the needle twice. We're going to pull up a loop, wrap around again, pull it through two, wrap around, pull it through two, wrap around, pull it through two, wrap it around twice. Again, we're going around the body of the stitch, wrap it around, pull it through two, wrap around, pull it through two, wrap around, pull it through two. And there you have your cable in the round. Take care. Bye-bye.